Hi, it's Clint from Autodesk. And in this video, I'm gonna show you everything you need to know about whole charts. So let's dig in. If we go over to our tables dropdown and choose whole table, all we need to do is select an origin and place our table. Whole tables are like any other table in Fusion. You can adjust the size of them and clicking on the table itself will allow you to choose which columns you'd like. You can choose your direction and we can choose to arrange our tags by either size or position. We can also rename our whole table. So maybe instead of whole table, we'd like to call this whole chart and you'll see our updates come through. A nice addition to our whole tables is that they understand ordinate dimensions. So if I place an ordinate dimension over here and let's place a couple more, we'll place one over here and one over here. These ordinate dimensions are based off of the zero of our origin point. So if I move my origin point to hole number A8 over here, that ordinate dimension becomes zero. Hole number A8 is now at zero, zero. And my origin indicator has actually changed shape. If I move the origin indicator to a different position, you'll see it updates accordingly, as does my whole table and the ordinate dimensions. Whole tags can be moved individually or by box selecting, you can move multiple whole tags at once. If you end up with a very long whole table, clicking on the triangle will allow you to split the table to make it a little shorter and easier to fit on your drawing. Hope you enjoy using our whole tables and we'd love to hear some feedback from you.